Hey, what's going on guys? It's Ethos here and I welcome you to the rope dash tutorial. So today I'm going to be showing you how to rope dash. And if you don't know what rope dashing is, uh, I just made a video on it uh, yesterday. It's basically a glitch where you uh, dash into a, a zip line and then it'll fling you back with a lot of speed and you can be hop. It's really cool. Lots of, you can do a lot of stuff with it. Hit a lot of cool clips, you know, mess with kids, show your friends, all that. It's, it's a really cool mechanic in the game and um, Wright definitely isn't happy about it. So try to do it while you still can, all right? So anyways, Wright actually kind of patched the rope dash. They try to make it so that now you sink on the rope as you dash into it so the split one is definitely a lot harder to do but you can still rope dash and and there's actually two good ways to do it now especially on the ice box i'll just be showing you guys how to do it on ice box but the basic mechanic of it is uh step one is to just dash and attach just like that so then you kind of get, get flung back like that as you see but obviously now with the new patch you kind of get you know glued to the rope still so you can't really detach from it as easily but there's two good methods to kind of detach from the rope and still maintain your momentum and i'll be showing you guys how to do that so yeah here's method one this one's probably easier I kind of came up with this myself. This is on a site here to deal with, you know, the smaller corners and whatnot. It's to dash, attach, and then jump, right? The second you come back here. So you're obviously you're going to dash at, like towards that wall, but with the second you come back, you want to jump and then that'll release you from the rope and then kind of be hop you into wherever you want to go. So I'd recommend doing it from back here to maintain the most speed, but this is kind of what it looks like. But you see, you can still get a lot of momentum. You can still detach from it very easily. It's, you know, a lot of great opportunities for cool looking clips. So yeah, I recommend you doing it from back here again, just because you don't want to hit that wall. If you do it from here, kind of, you know, kind of get stuck a little bit, but it's still not bad. You can also do it from back here. Is remember it's dash, attach, then jump. The second you come back like this, like that. And doing it with knives definitely like looks cooler and you can do cool stuff with it anyways moving on to method two um just coming out here to the other rope this one involves an updraft and shout out to my homie infamous for showing me how to do this because this one's definitely really sick and you can get you a lot of really cool looking clips and whatnot and you can do this actually out towards b or towards mid depending on whichever side you go towards first so if you want to go towards mid basically the idea is you want to updraft dash attach you want to hold your attach button again to detach for me it would be space to updraft v to dash e once to attach and then let go and hold down e on your way back to get that timing and then detach from it it is a timing thing to detach from it sometimes you'll get glued to it but you should be able to figure it out pretty easily so here's what it looks like like that also out to b so again updraft dash attach detach just like that and boom easy you can do this with a, a deagle uh or a sheriff i mean uh knives a knob whatever you want that's pretty easy to do as well so that's about it that's how you rope dash thank you guys so much for watching uh, make sure to go check me out on stream twitch.tv slash ethos i stream there every day at like 3 p.m eastern sometimes i actually might be switching it to more of a late night stream depending on how my scrims go also make sure to follow me on twitter i'm constantly posting there that's how you get the latest updates on everything ethos also make sure to join my discord server down below i'm always constantly in my discord server talking hanging out with the boys and go follow me on instagram because obviously you guys just want to see pictures of me in real life so i love you guys so much i appreciate you all so very much i hope you have a great wonderful day and i will uh, see you guys next time peace